hello guys welcome back to my channel how are you all doing today i'm back again with another stitch breaks um tutorial this time is with a curly hand so some people call it bohemian stitch braid fiesta stitch braid and today i will be showing you how it's done so i'm just parting a hair in the middle into two equal part right now and then i will be applying the shine and jam to the fine um the part uh, to make it look um neater and i'm just gonna put it away uh, while i walk on the other side so um she's getting the stitch um fitting braids so i'm gonna part each half of her hair hair into three um equal part so i'm done with the first uh, part and i'm just gonna apply the shine and jam and then um, put the rest of the hair away again and i'm gonna use my clip um, to hold it uh, for a better grip. So apply, after applying the shining gem, I'm gonna use my rat tail comb again to pop the hair again um, to give it uh, a more defined part. And I'm gonna apply the shining gem on the hair to slick it down. That's way it's easy uh, to stitch. Every product used for this tutorial will be linked down in the description box down below so please check it out so after applying the jam you're just going to use your comb to comb it through the hair and use the palm of your finger to um, lay it down so it flats as much as possible and you're going to um, cut out a piece of the hair that you're going to start braiding with and you're going to start braiding with the natural hair before you apply the extension hair and please excuse my um, nail polish. I was in the process of cleaning it out to get another one during my short break um, before my clients walked in. So I apologize. So um, you're just gonna keep adding hair as you're stitching at the same time. Adding hair until you get to the ends of our hair. So I used two different kinds of hair. I used the uh, regular expression here. This is the supreme one. It already comes um, pre-stretched and it's two um, pack in a box. So I also use the features um, Google call. So the Google call is the hair I had it at the tips of um, each braid. So that is what gives it the bohemian goddess um, look. So please check the description box um, to get the hair if you're interested in the hair and also any of the products will be linked down in there. bottom of the braids you're gonna take three strands of the curly hair and add it onto the braids and as you're braiding down you're gonna keep adding curly hair until is um, the size that you want so you're gonna keep um, braiding the curly hair into the braids you want to make sure it's um, braided in tightly so it's not um, too loose um, that way it um, lasts longer.
make sure you're measuring the braids with the other braids and when it gets so it's equal part at the end um, so when you get to the end of the um, braid you're just going to take your rubber band two little ones and you're going to use it to secure it Don't stop, 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 don't stop
to reduce any frizziness and to lay it down um, perfectly so um, for this style you don't need to put the ends in, in hot water because it's called the ends so you're just gonna use your needle and your thread and you're just gonna hold um, the back of the braids the hair um, together that way it's all together it's not um, moving all over the place this makes it um, I think this makes it um, last longer as well so you're just gonna hold it um, together with the needle and thread also as you're um, threading it you want to make sure it's invisible um, it's not showing as you can see I'm going in and out of the braids that way you can hardly tell that it's all together with a thread I'm 
down, down the thread and trim it with your scissors and style it. And that's pretty much it for the style. And I'm going to show you guys the finished look. something like this look at how pretty those curly ends is um, i hope you guys enjoy this tutorial as much as i did if you do please click the like button also please leave me a comment down below to let me know what you guys think thank you so much for watching this tutorial if this is your first time on my channel please don't forget to click the subscribe button also please turn on your notification bell that's why you don't miss a thing. My Instagram and Facebook pages, I saw that one too. Thank you so much for watching and have a blessed day. Bye.